so sorry about last night. Um, I didn't take a lot of video because um, I got frustrated. But this one's already back to stock. Um, as you can see, no more HVAC on Mark's car. Put the stock steering wheel on it. Um, and yeah, it was a pain in the butt taking out the wire harness off of this one. And same thing with the other one. Uh, my girl's still not on. Uh, today, I'm actually going to put the headlights on. As you can see, I had to get the stock pigtails because he was running the JDM ones. Or the HIDs, so I had to put these. Um, and the lights that I bought don't have no light bolts. That's the reason I still haven't slapped them on. I'm gonna see if I have um, if I have some extra ones. Oh yeah, there's my Molly rear. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. One of Pet Boys and I bought the lights. Damn, these things are expensive. Seventeen dollars for each one. That's like almost forty bucks right there. See, thirty-eight. Headlights are in. They look like JDM or OEM HIDs, but they're not. They're fake. Just gotta clean them and put the rear bumper and change the tail lights, and this car should be ready for sale. So if anybody wants to buy it, let me know. I'm asking 35. Um, it has 147k miles. Very well maintenance. I could vouch for that. Yes, one owner. I'm actually the second owner, but you're probably gonna be the second owner. So now to take off the tail lights and put the regular 2000 headlights. And yeah, this is the headliner. It's already sold and the door inserts. Tail lights out. That's the 2000. This is the 03. Pretty easy to install. Just take off three bolts or three nuts. One, two, three. Disconnect the wire harness, which is right here. And to get access, you just take off these. Trying to find a rear bumper silver. Hopefully it's here still. It's pretty old. The car has been here for like a month already. Who knows if it's still here or if that rear bumper is here. I'm also looking for a stock exhaust. Trying to make that Celica stock. We'll see if we find any here. Hopefully. So there they are. Two Celicas here. No rear bumper. But at least I didn't come here for nothing. I had the stock GT exhaust, and that's what also I came here for. Um, so I'm gonna take off the best looking one, or the best condition on both of these. Um, see what you take home. And let me look around. Maybe they took off the bumper and it's somewhere here, laying around here, or they hit it somewhere. Hopefully. I've already changed the cover right here. Just two screws right here. I had to switch this to. Uh, this is the other one, a CF. So there's the screws and two screws right here. Right now I'm working on taking off the exhaust. I have the stock exhaust in here, taking off the TRD. Um, and it has three hooks, one, two and three right there i'm working on this one right now what i like to do is just put a screwdriver through here and then just pry it out 
Someone's out. I uh, forgot to tell you. Uh, and then you have two bolts over there. Size 14 on a TRD. It doesn't come with the nuts. Well, they're on there. So you have to put it on on the OEM one, um, the stock one. It does have it welded in there, so you don't have to worry about the nuts. I already took them off. Now, just for the last hanger that's right here. Bosses out. Uh, now to put the stock one on. And as I told you guys before, the nuts on this are welded. On this one, it's not. So. So there it is. The exhaust is on. The one in the back was being a pain in the ass. But I got it. So I just need to put the screws back on. Size 14. Should be fairly easy. Then put on the rear bumper and the front lip. Give it a wash. Clean it up. And it should be ready for sale. like that the rear bumper is on I installed the front lip also so just need to clean up and it's ready for sale see the lip right there well, we out here about to wash this baby for the first time and get it up for sale Not to dry it off and vacuum a little bit. So there she is, completely stocked, clean, ready for sale. So I'm out here at the junkyard. I forgot to tell you guys uh, the side skirt off of this one came off skirt on this car came off uh, reason being is because I only put the clips right here and I didn't put the ones in the bottom so it came off so that's why I'm in the junkyard uh, I'm gonna get the last touch of this car and it should be so should be for sale pretty soon or after I get the side skirt so we found them right here it's gonna be a little difficult because there's gonna be one of these down there Let's see how I do it. Look at that, the side screws on, ready for sale. I'm gonna put some signs on it and then get it ready. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment, and suggestions down there. Mouts.